All right, so good evening. My name is called Valentine, the creator of Live to Mike History. And can we just get this? I'm catching this Africa. Can we get that? Boom, 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 boom. Okay, so today was, let's say, still is my birth, my queen, the greatest human being for me to ever have lived. Today is my mother's birthday, and yes, we celebrated. Didn't didn't film it today because it's something that's private. Some stuff in life you keep close to you, you keep it private, and you keep it just for yourself and your family. So I didn't record because that's more like private stuff. But today was a day where I decided to eat as much carbs as I want, as much protein. I was just eating and eating and eating and just like, it just felt different because usually, even though I don't weigh as much anymore, I eyeball things, you kind of realize, oh, I'm not going to eat this much today because it's got this amount of carbs. I'm not going to eat over that. But today I said, let yourself go and just, oh, by the way, if you hear noise in the background, Obviously the event is still going on, I said let me just film this, I let me just go out, out of my way to film this because I'm getting kind of tired, it's been a long day. Um, so yes, um, I said to myself today, I'm going to eat what I want, whenever I want, and yeah, obviously I had more carbs today because obviously um, in my culture as well we have a lot of rice, yams, um, but yeah, there's also a lot of chicken as well, so I had a lot of chicken on the barbecue and I had a lot of rice, I had a lot of them. Um, fizzy drinks as well like Pepsi, Tango, it's, it's very different to sometimes have normal things you still need to live like I know we go through this whole you know health as well yes but you still need to live and it felt a bit weird because I'm not used to that so it's, it was a great feeling to actually relax eat what you want and just still enjoy family moments so again my mom's birthday happy birthday to the most highest most exalted one that has given birth to me um family is truly everything you have family so great day and i said let me just film this video because i thought i wanted to be a kind of scenario because a lot of people are still confused about some something so can i take this off because it's feeling a bit i will leave it on it's, yeah um <laughs> so i have a little bit of a scenario um hopefully i'm not sure you can hear that that's basically the trains um yeah anyway a lot's going on noise here there i'm just sorry about this but I said, let me just film this because i've got this scenario, scenario everyone's asking me the same question so i have a scenario so there's a crossfitter who is struggling to build muscle this crossfit is struggling to build muscle training six days a week doing no crossfit training very high intensity cross is very high impact so this person is struggling to build muscle um yeah one why can't you build muscle training six days a week on about three thousand calories um also does evening walks in the evening as well sometimes um, and struggling to build muscle so why is this crossfitter not gaining x y and z amount of muscle let me just make the scenario for you if you're a crossfitter you can do this with anything so one of the reasons why the crossfitter is not building muscle is first of all he's utilizing too much energy than he's burning which means if you're utilizing too much energy then you are technically burning you're not going to be you know building muscle you need to be in kind of a surplus to build muscle so first of all he needs to or she whoever needs to first of all drop the session down remember homeo i'm sorry about all this noise there's a lot going on so first of all is homeostasis with human beings things need to be at a natural state so he's doing training six days a week doing crossfit i would say drop the sessions down to five even four days a week slowly and try and do more sessions based on lifting heavier weights, if that makes sense. So if you're based on sessions that's resistance and progressive overload over time, and you are slowly cutting down the, the high intense, intensity, like for example, you can't be doing long distance running and trying to build muscle at the same time. It's just not possible. So the, the thing I'd always say is drop the session down slowly, homeostasis, do it too drastically. The results won't be as how you want it to be in the body, you know, can't respond to something that's so drastic slow and steady truly wins the race in this process so up the calories so if you're 3000 calories maybe 3500 slowly and see how the body responds to that and then say at the same time you would um you would drop the crossfit sessions down if you still want to you still want to do your crossfit you love crossfit and you want to slowly add more progressive resistance type training 
into your routines if that makes sense and slowly you will start to build muscles over time but the same thing track your nutrition track your calories etc track the weight you're lifting that is progressive load over time and i'm telling you you will see some kind of change so this is the question i was actually answered i do crossfit and i'm you know strong to build muscle the main thing progressive overload and the main thing is being in a surplus try that and see if there's some kind of change you can even use this in your lifestyle if you're strong to build muscle so ask yourself am i utilizing or am i doing too much activity at once Am I doing too much activity at once? Am I burning too, like, burning too much? It's so easy for us to burn too much sometimes. Yes, we're a nation where we don't burn enough, where we, we get too lazy, but at the same time, we're also a nation that sometimes, a lot of us, we tend to do a lot sometimes, especially when you're naturally active. You can go overboard. I want to train in the evening, I want to do this. Whatever you're doing, ask yourself, are you in a surplus? And ask yourself, are you, you're, is your training progressive? Are you slowly increasing the weight, whether it's sets, reps, you know, drop sets, super sets, sets, giant sets, I can go on and on and on and on and on. So make that specific to yourself and, and yeah, continue to scale from there. Um, it's literally that simple. Remember, training is not as hard as you think it is. You want to just make it simple for you and scale. Scale yourselves from there and it's literally that simple. I'm going to wrap this up. It's been a long day. Again, it's my mother's birthday. Let me continue to go out there. Sorry about the noise. Let's continue to go out there. Let's continue to live. Let's continue to live to make history. Why? Because you and I, we have one space in time. We have one life. Let's freaking swipe. <laughs> Let's freaking swipe out.